Back Country 98.1. We are joined by our very own Billy Gilman. How are you? Good morning. How are you? Very first question. Are you still living in Rhode Island? I am back and forth. Been in Nashville for quite some time now working on this project that just came out. But my home is where my family is and my friends and that's Rhode Island. This is a great project going on and this is to have people donate 500,000 pairs of shoes? Yes. We were actually writing for my own record and not really coming up with any kind of ideas that day. You know, so they already had this idea premeditated. We've got a title. It's called The Choice. We're thinking about maybe getting one or two people on board with you, singing the song, and we'll give it to a great charity, Souls for Souls. After we wrote it, started to say, okay, now who would I feel comfortable asking to be on this record with me? So I figured I'd ask Leanne Rhymes first. She started out young. We've traveled together, and she said yes. I said, if I go along the lines of who I've traveled with and we kind of grew up with, you know, like Reba McIntyre, for instance, I toured with her one of my very, very first tours when I was six months old. <laughs> um, she automatically said yes, and then I asked my buddy Keith Urban, and by this time it started to like snowball, and we found out that 18 artists on one record in country music has never happened before, so it's kind of crazy that we got that many people for this charity. You mentioned Reba and Keith Urban, but Alan Jackson as well, Kenny Absolutely. Rogers. He was on the original We Are The World. It's, that kind of brings it really full circle, if you will. There's like some of the brand new artists as well as the veterans, Randy Travis and Kenny and Leanne mixed with Steve Holy and Josh Turner. So it's kind of a nice mix. That was the whole point. We have the newest, but yet we have the biggest icons that country music has had, really. Hopefully we can uh, make that mission possible. One download is one pair of shoes. I cannot believe that just for the cost of a download, someone who wouldn't otherwise have them can get a pair of shoes. Get this. Half the world does not own a pair of shoes, so that's 2.3 something billion people. 300 million of them are children. I thought, we really got to make this mission happen. And in that process, Regal Cinemas, they're running a clip of it in every single theater, in front of every movie. CMT did the big world premiere, the video last week. So it's just crazy to see the people that have come out to get on board with this project. Not only does everyone need shoes, but there's so many diseases and things you can get from walking around without them. There's just so many factors, rather than just being comfortable and looking cool in a pair of shoes. It goes way, way beyond that. Thank you so much for calling in about it. If people want to find out more, I know that you've got it all over your website website, which is billygilman.com, then they can go to iTunes to download the song? Yeah, one download is one pair of shoes. It's as simple as that. Thanks so much. Don't be a stranger. Stop in anytime. Thank you so much.